Pokemon Ultra Moon is known to be one of the hardest Pokemon games to beat, and I decided to Nuzlocke it in the most difficult way possible. All Pokemon, items, and even the totems that we fight are completely random, and even with a busted team, some parts of it are insanely hard to win. I'm known for being not very good at challenges like this, so this was the ultimate task to become a master at Nuzlocke. I randomized Pokemon Ultra Moon and turned it into the hardest main series Nuzlocke, and this is how it went. <sighs> The music already hurts. Oh no. We are back. We're so back. Enjoy the beginning of the Nuzlocke, which uh, as you know, it's a lot of intro that we have to go through. Can we see this intro 200 times? Chat, come on. Yeah, give me a little bit of credibility. You don't think I can get through this in a convenient time frame? All right, chat. Are we going to be a boik or a gurk? I saw a lot of Gurk, and because I have brown hair, naturally, we'll go with the blonde one. Now, what is my first name going to be? Obviously, the winning run, as we all know. Grum. I don't think we're gonna start with Grum. Grum is kind of gross. It's going on YouTube, Chad. Just remember, just keep that in mind. Grum. My name's Grum, everyone. Uh, sit back and relax, chat. We got a cutscene to watch. That's right, baby. Strap in, we got a whole bunch of these coming. I'm just gonna throw this out there, chat. After I finished the first Nuzlocke, or for this specific one, you guys were all like, oh man, I missed the good old times. Remember the remember the trainer school? Mm, I missed it so much. But then during it, you're like, John, this is taking forever, finish it up. So all I'm saying, chat, enjoy it. Enjoy, pink room, cause I'm a girl. Write that down, that's a fact. I'm such a hater, no. Girl power. Am I, am I right, ladies? Uh, there's no ladies here. While we're in the middle of this, I might as well explain what the rules are for this. I feel like everybody knows what a Nuzlocke is. However, let me explain to you the additional rules that are set for this challenge. Number one, we have a level cap, which we don't have it for the first island because it's so easy to go over. I, I believe that's what we used to do. Forced evolutions at level 40. <laughs> Let's just say hypothetically, I'm supposed to encounter a Pichu. Boom, it's a Raichu instead, but it could be either Raichu or a Lolan Raichu. Ooh. Admittedly, I think I made it harder than last time, which you might say is a dumb decision. I would like to think it's a unique decision. All of the important trainers and boss battles have one extra Pokemon. Which is, I, it won't be a problem, right? I think it's gonna be fine. I think we'll be chilling. At the end of the day, it's one, the friends we made along the way, and the fun. Let's just play. Battle style is set to set, which is obvious. Did I mention the set damage? Yeah, no set damage moves. We don't mess around with that. Dragon Rage, too easy. Sonic Boom, too much boom. Hang on, I know you. You're Grum, right? That's me. Call me Grum, baby. It stands for Gamer. Um, as you can see in front of me, we have three starters. We have Rowlet, Litten, and Poplio. Although they appear in the overworld as these Pokemon, in reality, they are completely different. And every single attempt we do, they will be randomized. And unfortunately, we can't just go through each one and be like, okay, this is what we get. This is the next one we get. So what we're going to do is see them all at once. And then you, yes, you, you get to vote. What are our options? <laughs> okay, on the surface, there's one that looks really good, right? There are a couple of downsides to it. I don't think Gengar really has a lot of good moves, especially during level up. Knowing my luck, we encounter a lot of ghost types. And also, you guys love bird. So I think I already know where this is going. Unfortunately, Chad, <laughs> although none of these were really good options at the end of the day, we are bird owners. What name do we give our first starter in this adventure? I say first because I can't imagine this run's gonna get very far just off of this chat. You want me to name it after you? Oh, right, because it's chat on. <laughs> I thought we were just on our egotistical grind. We're like, yeah, it's gotta be me. <laughs> yeah, sorry, my bad. <laughs> kind of forgot the name of it. If you think this is gonna be an easy challenge and you've never seen me play this, there are a lot of reasons why that's not true. I think we're forced, yeah, this is our first encounter. We don't have Pokeballs. That would have been nice. <laughs> However, we were blessed with one. Let's see what your moves are. What is Chadot's moveset? It sure is something. And all of the items are randomized as well. We can make some friends. Oh, we have to fight him right now? <laughs> well, I'm sure this is gonna be an easy battle. We just need like a Caterpie, Weedle, 
something light, right? Bronze on. <laughs> that isn't very easy to beat. It could be a flinch. If you just do that another 10 times, we're good. We're knocking it out. Is this really the first battle that we're going to experience? Listen, I know what you're thinking. That's not a good sign. However, the run is still good. We don't have balls yet, so we haven't lost. We just didn't win. Hi, John. Hi. I'm your biggest fan. I watch all your videos and all your streams and I even have your limited edition merch and I also bid on a lock of your hair on eBay that the seller assures me is completely legit and not cow hair. How cool is that? Anyway, can you give a shout out to my friend in the chat? They'll know who they are. Shout out to your friend. Nuzlocke everyone! It's Nuzlocke! Yeah. How about chat out everyone? Mm, I love chat out! Okay, encounter number one. What do You're we get? You're doing an Alola news lock? What is this? 2021. <laughs> Little guy. You think that's bad? I know some of you guys think that's bad. But he's just a little guy. And the best part, Route 1, 100% catch rate. We can't fail this. It is statistically impossible. Sweet baby Meryl, everyone. This is claimed, and I cannot believe the name. This is very obviously a setup. And the craziest part is that Arlie is already a mod. She's been a mod. It doesn't even fit. So how in the world am I gonna- Why? Why is this claimed? That's the subscriber, not the name? Oh, right. Sorry. Sorry, my bad. Let me fix it. This was the name they claimed. I'm sorry for making a mistake. Oh, oh, in my head, I was like, oh, Graveler, fine. Why did it have to be Electric Graveler? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what do we do? <laughs> okay. What does Confide do? It tells the target a secret. <laughs> what? I probably should reduce its special attack because it's going to go for an Electric move, right? Why? I can't believe I'm being this analytical on the first battle. It only has Tackle as an attacking move. Okay. No, 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 it's good. It's good. I'm just, I'm doing a little bit of chip damage and then I'm bringing in Meryl. Don't. Let's not do that. Oh no. Okay, well now I have to swap. Oh, that's nothing. We're chilling. It's just gonna take a really long time. Okay, chat. We beat it. I don't know how, but we did do it. Oh. That's pretty good. I mean, the odds of us getting to the point of reviving it is pretty slim, but it could happen. You don't know. Let's go. Rival battle. Three Pokemon. <laughs> Not a great start. <laughs> But, Meryl's got water gun. <laughs> what moves does a Rhyperior have at this level? Ow, horn attack? Oh, <laughs> horn attack. <laughs> no, 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 Don't let that deter us. I misclicked, because I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> okay, but listen, that paid off. That paid, that was a smart play. It's throwing, it's throwing. It's quad week, right? Phys defensively not great. Solid rock. Chat, I don't know abilities. Oh my god, you threw! Okay, okay! Alright, maybe I can turn this around! It is unfortunate there are two more that we have to deal with. Oh! You actually have your start- Oh, I guess you're supposed to have Poplio. Wait, no, this is actually the starter you're supposed to have! Because I picked Poplio. Oh, I forgot this game is on easy mode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they choose the one that's that it's your weak, you have the advantage. I can't speak. Okay, one more. We I feel like we fought the hardest thing, right? Timber! I can be Timber, believe it or not. This chatot is shockingly better than I thought it would be. Oh! Run number one's not looking too bad. Chat, we have done it. Against all odds, we have made it 
to the trainer school. Now, if you know anything about this location, it is known to be not kind. However, this time, we have knowledge. There are four trainers that we have to fight. And then, a final boss battle. I say we get a new encounter. I mean, scope lens. What needs a scope lens? <laughs> Something that's not good with accuracy, but really strong? Get laid? Ooh! That is a good find! Question is, I don't know if we can knock it out. Or not, I don't want to. I know I can knock it out. I don't know if I can deal damage to it to be able to throw balls. Because it's strong. Oh no. <laughs> I could have quick balled. That is a very good point. We'll catch it. It's cool. Day in the life. Gamer. Okay. Two shakes so I know it's real. Was that- did I just use another Leer? I mean, I wasn't paying attention. I was too busy... ...wanting to catch it. Okay, at least it's real. We know it's real. Come on! Yes! Yes! Ooh, I'm a gamer! Run one has to be it! What's a 45 catch rate? Never heard it. What do I name it? Borny? I don't even like how that sounds. Oh, good horny bug? Grow up! That's gross, chat. You sexualizing bugs? Oh, wait, that's actually a really- It's not a good name for Heracross, but it's a good name. Noodle. In all caps. So you go, NOODLE! Oh. <laughs> the trainer stool strikes again! Oh, that's really bad! <laughs> okay, on the upside, we have Meryl! <laughs> Meryl is the only counter we have. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to bubble a lot. Oh, I don't know what you just used, but I dodged it. You wouldn't. You wouldn't. Meryl's hands are too small to hit itself. <gasps> it's true! <laughs> this is not good. Isn't water gun stronger? This thing is fast. I'm trying to get down its speed. I guess I can water gun. Actually, no, it's the same. Don't you dare. No, 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 no. We've got it. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. Maybe I eat it? Meryl! That was your shot, baby! That was your chance! Poor little baby. Alright. I honestly think we can still get through this. Okay, I'm starting to think we're not getting through this. John, is it randomized? No, I think normally you fight a mega Aerodactyl in the trainer school at level seven. Wait a second. Wait a second! Is it bird time? Say what you will, but this might be a huge throw. This might be the throw of the century. Chat on, you can do it. No, Chetta, no, no, don't! Don't listen to haters, you got it! <laughs> this Aerodactyl and every heck in the bug! At least the trainer school really lives up to its its uh, infamous history. All right, that is one run down. I just think it's an excuse to be more prepared. Shut and up! Not shut up! I know! I lost! Ah! Run number two, everyone! Run number two! This is what we signed up for. 13 months of Jauntant. Have we already lost a run? When I left the stream, we were at the Young Goose. No, so... Funny you mention that. So many technical problems today. It's been mind-blowing, but we've, we've just sat through it, worked it all out, and we're looking good. We're, it's looking promising this time. It's starter time, run number two for sure is the run. Our starters last time were not great, so I think that the bar is low enough that anything above what we got is amazing, right? There's no way. The only thing that we have going for us is maybe, maybe it's Mega Mawile. If it's not, none of these are good. <laughs> Wow, this is not even close. Binacle stands are in shambles right now. Well, I don't think we even entertain the poll anymore. That's pretty obvious. You guys are 
pretty much down for a while. Cool. It's a 50-50 shot. It's either Mega or it's not. <laughs> what am I gonna do with you? <sighs> All right. What do I name you? <laughs> Megan. Mm, yep, Chad, you... You haven't changed, that's for sure. How battle. I may not... I may not have a Mega, but Breeder Alex is toast. I mean, I have Astonish. <laughs> Don't you even think about it. Don't you even think about it. Mawile may not be good, but at least I won. Does the eject button still work? Oh no, I did forget about the eject button. In this moment, I want to explain the eject button, but I'm not going to. This is going to be ancient lore that I'm going to gatekeep. You either know or you don't. Are we trapped at the trainer school yet? No, no, we're not. Because you know why? This Pokemon will destroy the trainer school. Body it. Now, I know this looks bad. Pidgeotto has a, has, um, it's base stat total. This sucks. Megant? We're not naming every Pokemon Megant. I'm just naming this because they spelled it wrong. They want to name it Mac and Cheese, but they spelled it Mac and Chess. Okay, I think it's important to note, while this may seem like a very exciting moment for all of us, you can't use Mega Evolution until the end of the game, so. <laughs> At no point will this ever be helpful. Battle number two of how... That seems slightly overkill. However, I think I'm fine. Yeah, I can just, I can just astonish this. <laughs> All right. Are you joking? There's no way you are a Stallmon! <laughs> uh, Recover has 10 power points, right? Sand attack. But like, what is that really gonna do? Oh, maybe, maybe you are cooking. Maybe you're onto something here. This is evil. Chat, how much do we like bird? How much do we like, are we fans of bird? Or are we just, is, you know, we getting checkmated on this one. Bye, bird. <sighs> yeah, me inside. One. Okay. Wait! Technically, we didn't lose. It's an optional battle. We lost. We, we did lose. We did lose. But you know what, chat? You know what they call that? It's a rolling star, baby. All right, chat. Maybe we're not winning because we've been a girl. <laughs> that's not ex that's not what I meant. I meant the maybe <laughs> girl power. What is our name? Actually, you know what? I'll take the reins on this one. You know what? Just just we'll add a little flair to it. Let's add a little sun because we're happy and having a good time. Run number three. What are our options? This is actually promising. Sceptile, Stuffle, and Ampharos. If it was a beware, it'd be a little bit better, but I mean like, that's a pretty insane list of Pokemon. Chat has voted Sceptile. And here's the thing, even if this isn't Mega, it's still pretty good. Let's see. We are over two on Megas. However, Sceptile is still good. <laughs> Not naming this one Megan too. How? I did lose to you last time, but guess what? Not today, Christine. <laughs> Not today, Christine. Sneasel? I don't know what moves I have. I assume I have Pursuit and Leave. Okay. I don't know how I won that, but I did. Let's get a new Pokemon. It's time. So I'm gonna go with Sceptile. <laughs> That's a great thing to go with Sceptile. Perfect. Now we're cooking. Finally, a Mega. 
Meg can. How battle? We ran it back. We've got a better team. And the best part is you won't have any fire types to beat my team. That's fine. Oh. Pinsir, what it you this is what you brought to the table? This is a gross move set. You should be ashamed of yourself. Leftovers? Yeah, no, I gave it leftovers. Don't give it credit. Wait. Oh no, we're chilling. Okay, 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 one down. Further than last time. It's stabbed to aerially? What is aerially? Oh. <laughs> Chat, it does not matter what aerial it is, not in the slightest. I forgot to set it to set, but it's fine, because it doesn't matter. Oh! Oh! Okay! Okay! That was scary! Wait. Grass! Grass monkey! Wait, so why is it- why is it flying? I mean, cool, we won. I need to learn my types. Oh, because it's flying type. Yep, I got it, guys. I got it. I'm here. I'm here. If you play any Pokemon game for the first time again, what would it be? Probably the Pokemon PC uh, Photoshop Red Edition, not blue. I always like making little posters. That's honestly one of the funniest things that Pokemon has ever done as a, as a company, is they made a Photoshop app. Let me just find the name of it. You know what's so embarrassing about this? The first result is my video talking about it. Pokemon Project Studio. So true, that's what it was. They released Pokemon Project Studio on the PC. The best part about it though, is they had a red version and a blue version. You guys remember Kid, Kid Picks? I think it's what that was called. It was like the PC game where you could just like, you could draw with it. It's almost like Mario Paint in a way, except it was more like Photoshop-esque. You could make like birthday cards, envelopes or whatever. I used to do it to make birthday cards. I w it wouldn't be for the birthday. I would just like think about like, oh, be, if I had a birthday party, this is what it would look like, the invitations. So it had all 151 Pokemon, but it was split half and half. So in order to get all of the Pokemon to use on your banners or whatever you were making, you need to buy both the red and the blue version of this PC app. And they were like 30 bucks a piece. One of my other favorite childhood PC game memories is I played a game, we went to like this mom and pop, it was like a department store, but it was a mom and pop department store, which is like, have you ever been to one of those in your life? Because mom and pop stores generally have like one thing, right? It was like a Walmart owned by a family and it was like a small store. They had a bunch of stuff. One thing they had to check out was a CD-ROM for a game called Build City. And essentially what it was is you would just play a farming simulator in a way. It's almost exactly like City Skylines, except if it was made in 2002. So you play, you have money and you place down buildings and then you place down schools and then you place down offices and then you make money and you, just, and you make crops and then you make money and then you try to not go into the negative and that's when you lose. Over time, I managed to build up my city to the point where it was consistently farming money and I didn't have to touch anything. I just looked at it to see how much money I was making. It was like, it was slowly going up. I was making thousands of dollars in game and I'd filled out the entire thing so nothing could be added to it. It was in, in reality, a perfect town that I made. Then one day, we had like some family friends come over. There's like five of them. And they're like, hey John, do you have any games? I'm like, oh yeah, I have some PC games. I can show you my city that I made. And I was like, oh, it's perfect. And so I showed them and this girl came over and she's like, oh, let me try. And she deleted two buildings and replaced them with crops immediately the money started going down. And it was one of those things where I was like, okay, that's not a problem. That's not a problem. I can get rid of the crops and replace them back with houses. The issue is that the houses I put there built up over time because they had tiers. You had like a little hut and they'll slowly go up and they're all mansions. Because they were huts and not mansions, it immediately tanked the ecosystem and it went all the way down and the money started going into the negatives. And this is her reaction. She's like, oh, that's weird and left and I just sat there as my economy went into the negatives and I lost and I never played the game again. I think we are due for another encounter because if we're fighting anything even close to a mega Aerodactyl again, I would like to be at least slightly prepared. All right, it's something, it's something. 
I forgot how slow the shakes are in this game. Hey chat, hey, can you do me a solid? Can you just, can you, Graveler understands that he's the least ideal on the team. Can you gas him up a little bit? Oh, no way! Graveler! That's so sick! Oh, it's gonna be so strong on the team! Wow! Oh, that's so good and not bad. He's with a catch of football on the on the fourth down in the World Series. No, Super Bowl. Jeez, never mind. Sports, everybody. We're going to OG. We're going wrong. No Mega Aerodactyl. Okay. Where are you getting these Pokemon? And why is it a great counter for me? This is stupid. This is dumb. This is actually a sick joke. And you have nothing. You don't have any rock moves. You have rock polish. I'm sorry. <laughs> rock! No! You have so much to live for! I think I have to focus energy. That's like my only way to win. We can play around it. I... Stupid, 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 stupid! Alrighty. There is a realm. Why do I even speak? Why, why do I even open up my fat idiot mouth? If I get a crit, we're chilling. We did it! We saved the day! Megan 2! Against all odds, chat, we're champions. One thing before, we have to heal. But additionally, there is a, uh, a thing that we have to do that we have not done, surprisingly, this entire stream. I need to get it, though. Hold on. There's a specific song that I need that I didn't, I didn't set up. Hold on. Jules still in the game, but he's feeling kind of stuck in Pokemon knows likes. He's running out of luck. Fainted Pokemon piling up like a losing streak. Every route he takes, like his boot just looking bleak. Bad decisions and crits. It's a tough road to tread. Team wiped out again. He's seeing red, but he won't back down. He'll train and he'll learn in this Nuzlocke challenge. <laughs> yeah, that was good. That was a good one. Goodbye, Pinster. Goodbye, Runk. Fallen guys. Although we have lost them, we still have Megant 2. This Pokemon will bring us to the end of the trainer school and then very obviously perish in the next battle. It's now time to fight the teacher, which is the finale of the trainer school. Let it be known, this has been usually a pretty hard battle. I also only have one Pokemon. It is Sceptile. However, I am weak to flying, ice, fire, and anything strong. How many Pokemon do you have? Oh, one. Okay, that's fine. I was worried. I thought it was only bad. Licky licky. I think it's fine, right? I mean, that's, that is not great. I have deja vu this is gonna add, end bad. No, definitely not. It's just throwing. Never mind. Well, that was significantly easier than fighting that little kid. I I don't know. They should have swapped places. So far, three runs in one day, not good, but we didn't end on a loss. So that's something to consider. So I think that's gonna do it for today. Hope you guys had fun. I had a ton of fun. Can't wait to continue this Nuzlocke. And surely this is the run. Goodbye, chatters.